All right, for Jessup Athletics, I'm Josh Carson, along with women's head coach Kurt Westendorp. And, you know, this is our ugly sweater night. We had that up in the booth, so this is what we got going on. But you know what wasn't ugly? It was the final score of that game and your free throw shooting. You went 17 for 19 from the line. Is that something that you're, you're doing in practice, like after running or anything like that, to keep that up? It's a bit, a little bit more of a concerted effort in the last two weeks, I will be honest, because to start the year, we are a little below where we typically are. I think as a team, we were sitting around like 65 or 66 percent. So it has been a little bit of a focus the last few days of practice. Um, we have good free throw shooters. It's just about focus, focus and getting reps. And tonight, they did an excellent job. I expect more like this the rest of the season. Well, that's huge in such a close game, and I want to talk about that. You had a 20-point lead at one point. Uh, the Red Hawks, they came storming back. They cut it to single digits multiple times. How were you able to fend off? How do you think your team was able to fend off that run at the end by them? Well, we've got a lot of kids with, with uh, experience, composure in some games like this. We've had several games like this so far this year where, unfortunately, we've gotten good leads and teams have been able to come back on us a little bit. But Liz Gayweiler at the point guard spot, she's a senior. She's got a lot of composure. We got really good possessions while they were coming back at us a little bit. And you have to expect that out of these teams. Like, they're not just going to roll over and die. They did a nice job competing against us. But we have a lot of older players that kind of know how to – I don't have to always burn a timeout, I like, to get them under control. And we got some good possessions down the stretch. Yeah, you talked about composure. Another word that really popped into my mind was resiliency. Um, what does that speak to, especially going forward? Is he going to get into conference play soon? Is that What does that speak to resiliency about your team, able to hold on to a lead like that, not completely crumble? Well, we got to keep learning how to win games like this where we might not be playing our best because today wasn't our smoothest effort at either end of the court. There was a lot of things that we needed to clean up. But when you can win a game going away by double digits when you still have those things to clean up, you take that as we go forward and be like, okay, we know that we don't have to always have our A game to win, but we do know that this wasn't up to par where we really want to be, but we'll always take the win. All right, for Jessup Athletics, you can find more coverage on jessupathletics.com.